In its efforts to promote entrepreneurship and create job opportunities for Guyanese, the government will soon operationalize the Belvedere Business Incubator and the Latham Industrial Estate. Minister of Tourism, Industry and Commerce, the Honorable Onish Walren, says the government is committed to completing these projects so that they can serve their intended purposes. The minister, during her budget 2021 presentation, noted that when the PPPC administration took office, the Belvedere business incubator was without electricity, equipment, or staff. The six pods touted by the previous administration to have specialized functions were also unoccupied. Over at the Letham Industrial Estate, Minister Waldron informed the House that construction work was incomplete. It was also without equipment. As a government, we commit to ensuring that the intended benefits of the estates are achieved. That is, improved infrastructure for business in order to spur economic development and job creation. That is why in Budget 2020, we have allocated $100 million for the procurement of equipment to operationalize and furnish the Lethem Incubator. The minister says the expression of interest for the leasing of the lots at the two facilities have been published and the applications which were submitted are being reviewed. We will soon see the Lethem Industrial Estate and the incubator serving its intended purpose. And all Guyanese, without regard to class, gender, orientation, or whatever lines they may come up may, to come up to divide us, will have a fair opportunity from this inclusive government to benefit. Feasibility studies for industrial estates in regions 2 and 10 will begin this year. Minister Waldron says additional sites and their associated projects will provide scores of good-paying jobs for citizens in these regions, thereby improving their standard of living.